Hi guys, in this quick video I'll be showing you how you will never miss an important announcement ever again. So, some announcements in the game have the ability to show a measure the box and pause the game, but it doesn't do this for every announcement. With this quick fix, you can choose yourself where it should pause, recenter, and give a box message. We can accomplish this by editing our announcement file, which is located in your Dwarf Fortress install folder. For most people, this will be in Program Files, Steam, Steam Apps, Common, and then Dwarf Fortress. Once showing your Dwarf Fortress folder, we need to find our announcement file. This is located in our data init folder. Then just open the announcement file. This is a list of all the different kind of announcements you can have in game. At the end of each line are some letters that tell the game how to handle each announcement. At the top is a description of the options we have. We will be mostly using box, P, R and the alert option. Box will cause a pop-up on your screen and pause the game. P will just pause the game and give a normal announcement. R will try to recenter on the event if possible and alerts will show us the shining red alert button at the top left of our screen. So to change the way an announcement is displayed, we just need to add or remove the options at the end of a line. So if we for example want to pause the game every time somebody dodges, we could do that by adding colon P to the combat dodge line here. Some descriptions are pretty obvious, but I would suggest going to the wiki page for announcements to read specifically what they do. I've gone through the list and picked some that I thought were important enough to change. This preset will also be available down in the description. I'm just gonna mention a couple that I think are pretty important to have if you would like to change the stuff for yourself. The first are a couple of different kinds of migrant arrivals. This is useful so you can see who's new and give them nicknames. And also if you want to separate them from the rest of the fort, this is a lot easier to do when they just arrive on the map. Another one that I think is pretty important are dwarves that are taken by a strange mood. It is nice to get a box pop up of this so we actually know it happened instead of finding out way too late. Same goes for all the other moods. Being alerted of a creature transforming on your map is also pretty important to know, so I've changed that to an alert as well instead of a small announcement. The last important one is a child being snatched. You want a box pop up for this since somebody presumably is already in your fort. And that was it for this video. Special thanks to reddit user Dr. Starker on the Dwarf Fortress subreddit for sharing this. I hope some of you found the video useful. And for those who don't want to do it themselves, the file is down in the description for my preset. Thanks for watching and expect more Dwarf Fortress content soon.